So you have a problem of definite integrals where we're given specific definite integral evaluations. Um, like for example, the definite integral from 2 to 6 of x cubed dx, they're already telling us that that's equal to 320, and so on. So we can start this problem by separating each term out into a separate integral. So this would be the integral from 2 to 6 of 6x cubed dx, and then the next term is minus, so minus the integral from 2 to 6 of 11x dx, and then the next term is plus 3, so plus the integral from 2 to 6 of 3 dx. Now that we have it separated into different integrals, we can pull all the coefficients out to the front. So this will make 6 times the integral from 2 to 6 of x cubed dx minus, we'll pull the 11 through to the front, 11 integral from 2 to 6 of x dx plus pull the 3 to the front, 3 integral 2 to 6 of dx. So now they tell us that the integral from 2 to 6 of x cubed is 320. So we can substitute the integral from 2 to 6 of x cubed dx is equal to 320. So this would be 6 times 320 minus, we can bring down the 11, and then they tell us that the integral from 2 to 6 of x dx is equal to 16. So we'll substitute that for the integral from 2 to 6 of x dx, plus bring down the 3, and they say the integral from 2 to 6 of just dx is 4. So we'll substitute that in for 4. So now we can just evaluate 6 times 320 is 1920 minus 11 times 16 is 176 plus 3 times 4 is 12. Add all of that up. We get 1920 minus 176 plus 12 is 1756. And that would be our fan final answer.